Hello and welcome to BedSU Students Election Question Time 2022. I am your host Heidi King and next up we are going to be hearing from your candidates for the role Co-Vice President Self-Identifying Woman. Co-Vice President is one of four full-time paid roles up for grabs in our current elections. There are two Co-Vice President positions, one reserved for self-identifying women and one reserved for self-identifying man or non-binary individuals to ensure gender diversity in our executive officer team. The successful co-vice presidents will be responsible for representing student views on campus, experience and equality, and all the stuff around the edges of your students and make up the wider student experience during your time here at the University of Bedfordshire. Each candidate will be asked three questions and will have 30 seconds to answer them in order chosen completely random by our number generator and they will be sig signalled when they have 10 seconds left to answer and will be stopped when, and when the time is up. They will each have an additional 30 seconds to sum up precisely why you deserve to vote for them. So let's meet the candidates running for co-vice president self-identifying woman. Your candidates are Daniela Hutchinson and Tabitha Ajaya and also reopen nominations. Reopen nominations features in all of our elections, providing you with a none of the above option. Brilliant, so let's get on to question one. So Tabitha, can you please tell us, as we move out of our corona related restrictions, our student societies are coming back to life on campus. How would you support students to run their own societies at bed this year? I would give students the opportunity to have social media takeovers so that they can promote their societies even further and also raise awareness for other people who don't know about their societies. Lovely, thank you. And question two, which is, BedsSU supports students in three student networks, including students with disabilities, LGBTQ plus students and BAME students. How would you improve the student journey for one of our diverse student groups? For disabled students, I would give them guest speech, guest lecturers, guest speeches, anyone who can help them provide more information on how they can further their education outside of university once they graduate, just so they know that there's more options out there for them. Brilliant. Thank you very much. And your final question today is, taking on one of these roles at BedsSU provides great opportunities to develop new skills. If you could learn a new skill instantly, what would it be and why? I would love to learn how to organise more events because I haven't really had an opportunity to do that currently in my life, which would be great to organise events for students and help more students be on campus. Yeah. Brilliant. Thank you very much. Thank you, everyone. So now, Tab, you have 30 seconds for a closing speech on why the students should be voting for you. I believe that students should vote for me because I would like to create more opportunities for students to enjoy their university experience more than just their academic side of university. Thank you. Thank you very much, Tab, and thank you to all our nominations. So once again, your candidates are running for co-vice president self-identifying women are Daniela Hutchinson and Tabitha Ajayo and reopen nominations. You'll see these candidates as well as those in the other categories out and about campaigning for your vote between now and the 10th of March when, closing, when voting closes at 4pm. Voting is open online 24 hours a day at bedsu.co.uk forward slash student elections. Simply just log on with your usual university login and details and then cast your vote. You can even vote for every single one of your candidates you've heard today because we use a single transferable voting system. When you reach your voting paper, you'll be asked to rank the candidates in order of preference. Put number one next to your first choice, number two next to your second choice, and so on and so on. This means that your first choice doesn't win, then your vote doesn't go to waste. It's simply transferred to the second choice. So please get online now and vote for who you want to represent for next year's BedsSU Student Executive Officer Team. Thank you.